Hello everyone. Welcome to IEEE Expert. Today we are going to see a project about completely new project. So the project name was Animal Footprint Classification Using Machine Learning. So actually in the title itself you can get that this project about animal classification. Animal classification means you have to classify the animal. Okay, what type of animal this is? You have to classify. But here completely we are using new technology. So what are the input we are going to take this project means? We are going to take footprints as an input. What's the meaning of footprints means? You all know. What's the meaning of footprints means? It's, it's the animal know the classification which you are turning. That animal footprints we have to classify. You may tell. We can easily say this is the dog footprint. This is the cat footprint. This is squirrel footprints. We can easily say. Like that you may say. But uh, show, here I can show some text sample for you. See that. Can you tell me the name of the animal which belongs to these footprints? Okay. It's impossible. Okay. If you're guessing correct means you are not getting any 100% accuracy, you know. So again, I'm showing. Can you let me know the footprint of the animal? Which animal footprints this one belongs to? It's impossible to predict. Actually, I can show you one more contents also for your reference. Hold on for a second. Um, just a moment. Okay. Can you let me know the footprint? Which animal? It's impossible, you know. So why we are going for this project particularly means in current time, in recent time. So everyone, all the people demolishing the forest, you know. So here everyone demolishing the forest. If you are demolishing the forest, if you are uh, uh, constructing our own houses, industries and all means, what will happen in future means, not in future, current, those days, current days it's happening everywhere. The animals, you know, those who are living in a forest, they may enter into the human dwelling places. So what will happen means, human animal facing will be increased in near future or current days. So if your human animal facing increases means, it may lead to major problems. So person death and many more problems will happen. Okay. So it is important to monitor or classify the animals. It is important to monitor the animals activities. So if you are you willing or if you are trying to monitor the animal activities means the only thing you may get is animal footprints. So based on the if you are animal mostly entering the night time or uh, not in, okay, when human not available that time only the animal may enter. So they may leave only one thing for you. It's their footprints. So for this purpose only we are going for this project. So listen to this project completely. In this project I explained the existing system, proposed system, everything clearly. So this is the project PPT. Uh, while purchasing this project we do explain this complete thing briefly. I do give the basic overview of this project. This project objective. So as I mentioned earlier, this project objective completely belongs to animal classification based on the footprints available. So if you are going for the footprints means there may be some features. What's the what is called the features means the pressure point. For example, one footprints you are recognizing or footprints you are analyzing means there will be some pressure points. What's the meaning of pressure points means take your hand, press it on your table or any floor. You may feel some pressure points. Okay. Some initial contacting points. Those points called as pressure points. As well as how much nails are available. What is the nail percentage? The nail removal. Everything we have to analyze. Okay. And one more thing here is the going for the footprints means always all the time not under percentage footprints are visible. Maybe they, they will be demolished by the nature or any other external factor. You may get the 20% of footprints, 100% whatever. But this project will classify you perfectly. This is the main advantage of this project. Okay. So this is the project advantage. Here we are using two proposed algorithms. One is Gaber feature extractor as well as PBN, uh, PNN, probabilistic neural network. These two algorithms we are going to use. So Gaber feature extractor used for feature extractor feature extractant as well as PNN, probabilistic neural network used by the classification that means training as well as testing purpose. So this is the introduction of the project. Here I may, I already mentioned that lot of research going on the animal classification. Okay, though this is the project completely out of for the recent researchers. So you may get the doubt, what is the existing technology for this project mean? In existing base paper you are going through now, in the base paper they have used sound classification. They classified, they directed animal based on the sounds 
which are which they producing so based on the sound only they have classified the animals but here major problem is most of the animals won't make any sound always okay they will make sound on a particular time only so you may not get a sound always and one more thing they may enter on the uh, when no one is available, that time only they will enter on your places, okay? So, it's impossible to record or recognize the sound particular time. This is the major drawback of the existing system. As well as the major existing was, I already told you, uh, the footprints, in case if you are taking any footprints, means maybe that can be smudged by the uh, sad or air like that. So, only partial things are visible. Those are the major problems. We have to give the solution for this also. So, as I mentioned earlier, if you are giving any footprints in your project, means maybe first of all it, it will convert it into gray scale form, okay, gray scale form. Then we can do some edit action, that background removal process and all. Then only we are going for the feature extraction, that pressure points, uh, nail count, what is the overall shape, features, colors, that only we have to take. For that we are going for the gapper feature. So, once feature extracted means what we have to do means we have to train those content. For the training purpose, we are going for the PNN probabilistic neural network as well as testing purpose also we are going for the same pn and only so this is the overall architecture of the project while getting the while purchasing the project we do explain these things clearly as well as these are the models of the project data collection model pre-processing model feature extraction model classification model these are the models available for this overall project the software which we are required was python we need python to run this project as well as conclusion of the project this is the overall conclusion of the project we are getting that we are getting around 97 to 100 percentage accuracy while testing for this project this is the overall uh, what i tell, uh, tell you overall reference for this project so then i can show the result for uh, report for this project the complete report also available for this project so you can get the complete report copy also while purchasing this project we do give the complete report copy also so everything available for this project perfectly so without wasting much further time i'm going to run this project here first of all i do taken some data set of the various animals for example if we going for the beer mean this is footprints belongs to various bears, various bears family, as well as cat, various cat family footprints I have taken, chicken, various chicken, as well as cow, various cow, and then crocodile, so various footprints I have taken, dog, duck, I have taken various footprints, so horse, these are the footprints, major footprints I have taken. This is my training code, labeled at the, sorry, train.py belongs to my training code, labeled at email belongs to my testing code, app.py belongs to my complete main code. This is my overall main code here. See that this is my overall main code. This is my complete, uh, this is my complete testing code. So all the codes implemented. So what I'm going to do means I'm going to run this project for you. For that I'm opening Anaconda software used to run this project then i'm just copying the path of the project this time paste to using cd space then enter python space app.py this is the command used to run this project here so once i enter the command means what what it will happen means it will build a website for this for you so i have used some uh, templates for you html files as well as python files what it will do means it will compile the uh, html files as well as python file into the new website this is your new website what you have to do means you have to paste it here so this is the home page for this project this is the home page so here i mentioned the abstract for this project also then what you have to do means you have to go for the login page the login command i have given was admin admin as a user id password which is in small letter admin admin so once login success means what you have to do means directly you can upload the footprints here what i have to do means i have to upload some footprints so hold on a second just i'm going for the test images a uh, test footprints here i don't know what type of uh, footprints it belongs to just i can take the random footprints here so this is the footprints you may see that is footprint happened long time ago just i'm going for the footprint checking once i enter the check footprints means it will enable the tensorflow while testing as well as give the result so see that Detected was wild cow. You may not need to worry. Sorry, you have to worry. Keep safe. It's selling that this footprints belong to wild cow. Okay, as soon as you can give the another one also. For example, these things I can give you. I don't know which footprints belongs to. Just I'm giving direction purpose. 
hold on for a second so you may get that <laughs> i was worried about the food things whether belongs to beer or something but the director that is director was kuril you no need to worry there is no risk this is the major major difference major advantage of project you can give any any sort of format any type of image you can get you can give this also okay see that so detect animals was that you no need to worry i can give you one more contents for you so it look like something cow something i can give you this contents we can check so this is wild horse you may see that this is wild horse you should keep safe so you can give any shot up any shot up contents here this one i am giving it look like a same squirrel image uh, squirrel footprints i do check that things please be wait so see that it's not about food squirrel it belongs to bear so you should keep safe it will detect everything perfectly whatever footprints you are giving so this one i am giving here uh, see that i don't know what it belongs to so it belongs to cat there is no risk okay i can give one more footprints for you uh, something what i have to give means uh, different one no, this one i don't know what is this completely different put uh, shot of footprints i have to check con this contents also so see that this is the rabbit you know to what type of footprint you can check everything of the perfectly you can give images from internet or you can take your uh, any shot of footprints lively you can upload it here it will detect perfectly okay also we can go for the chart page means we can give you some shot of classification result here so the data set which we have taken belongs to a cat image is 144 two images bear image 172 chicken image 180 this shot of footprints we have taken for the training so the overall accuracy of the project as i mentioned here overall training accuracy will be 97 testing accuracy will be 96 so everything working perfectly for this project okay so the, if you need to purchase this project means you need to purchase this project means so please contact iwexpert.com we do provide this project for best price okay thank you for your uh, time uh, please do subscribe and keep supporting us okay we do more like uh, we do more type of projects like this okay thank you